Hey everyone, welcome to the first episode of our exciting new series, GTA Vice City in Godot step-by-step -step tutorial series. In this series, we'll guide you through the entire process of recreating the iconic GTA Vice City using the powerful Godot engine. Whether you're a beginner in game development or an experienced developer looking to learn Godot, this series is designed to help you understand and master the essential techniques needed to build a game from scratch. In this series, we'll cover everything from setting up your project and creating a basic player movement system to implementing complex features like vehicle mechanics, NPC AI, and even mission scripting. By the end of this series, you'll have a fully functional game inspired by GTA Vice City that you can expand and customize. So let's start by taking a quick look at what you need to get started. First, you'll need to download and install the Godot engine. It's free and open source, making it a great choice for indie developers. In addition to Godot, we'll be using a variety of assets, including textures, models, and sounds. Don't worry, I'll provide links to all the resources you'll need in the description below. In our next episode, we'll dive right into setting up our project, importing assets, and getting our first scene up and running. But for now, let me give you a brief overview of what you can expect from this series. We'll be breaking down the series into several key episodes. Project setup player movement, world building, vehicle mechanics, combat and weapons, user interface, NPCs and AI, missions and objectives, audio and sound effects, optimization and performance, saving and loading, final touches, conclusion and next steps. Each episode will be focused on a specific aspect of game development, making it easy to follow along and apply what you learn. Throughout this series, I'll be here to answer your questions and provide support. So if you get stuck or need further clarification on any topic, feel free to leave a comment below or join our community. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you don't miss any episodes. If you find this series helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with others who might be interested. Have a good day.